Top 10 Fastest Cars in 2021 Hey guys welcome to Wave TV and today we shall be looking at Top 10 Fastest Cars in 2021. Before we start if you haven't subscribed please do so. Many would argue it's an incomparable adrenaline rush. But what cars are the fastest? Below you will find the comprehensive list of the 10 quickest cars in 2021, we've also compiled the fastest cars that are available on top speed. Number 10. McLaren Speedtail, 250 miles per hour. One of the newest cars on our list, the McLaren Speedtail, was introduced in 2019, and it's considered a spiritual successor to the iconic F1. But that's mostly because it features a three-seat layout with the driver's seat in the center. Unlike other cars on this list, the Speedtail is a hybrid, combining a twin-turbo, 4.0-liter V8 gasoline engine with an electric motor. McLaren says that the Speedtail is able to hit 250 miles per hour, which makes it the company's fastest vehicle yet. Number 9. Bugatti Veyron, 253.8 miles per hour. The standard Veyron, is the first production car that surpassed the 250 mile per hour mark. And it did it back in 2005 when it put an end to McLaren's long-standing record set with the F1 in 1993. The Veyron, fitted with an early version of the 8.0 liter W16, hit a top speed of 253.8 miles per hour on April 19, 2005. Its record stood for two years, but it was recaptured by the Super Sport version and then by its successor, the Chiron. This is the only Bugatti in our list that generates less than 1,000 horsepower. The W16 used in the original Veyron cranks out 987 horses and 922 pound-feet of torque. Number 8. SSC Ultimate Aero, 256.1 miles per hour. The Ultimate Aero is the car that briefly stole the record from the Bugatti Veyron. SSC set its record in 2007 with a twin-turbo version of the car. The Ultimate Aero hit a top speed of 256.1 miles per hour somewhere in West Richland and held the record until 2010. The Ultimate Aero was discontinued in 2013 after several limited edition models, but SSC is now working on a new contender for the world's fastest production car, the Tuatara. While the record car came with 1,183 horsepower and 1,094 pound-feet of tap, SSC increased power to 1,300 horses toward the end of production. It also switched the original 6.3-liter V8 with a 6.9-liter engine. Number 7. Koenigsegg Agera R, 260 miles per hour. The Agera RS may be the fastest of its kind, but the Agera R isn't far behind. Produced from 2011 to 2014, the Agera R featured the company's legendary 5.0-liter V8 engine, capable of up to 1,124 horsepower and 885 pound-feet of torque. The Swedish firm used this car to set a handful of records for production cars in 2011, but these were eventually reset by the Agera RS. Number 6. Bugatti Chiron, 261 miles per hour. Bugatti Chiron is introduced in 2016 as a replacement for the Veyron. The Chiron retains the quad-turbo W16 engine, but power was upgraded to 1,479 horsepower and 1,180 pound-feet of torque. The Chiron's top speed is officially limited to 261 miles per hour, which is a bit below the Veyron Super Sport. On the other hand, the Chiron Super Sport tops the list with more than 300 miles per hour, so we know there's plenty of potential under the hood. Number 5. Bugatti Veyron Super Sport, 268 miles per hour. The Bugatti Veyron may be 16 years old as of 2021, but it's still among the fastest supercars ever built. Actually, the record set by Bugatti in 2010 places the Veyron in fourth place with a top speed of 268 miles per hour. Bugatti built a special run of 30 cars called World Record Edition to celebrate the event, but these vehicles are limited to 258 miles per hour to protect the tires. The Super Sport was also the most powerful version of the Veyron, with its 8.0 liter W16 rated at 1,184 horsepower, 197 more than the regular model. Number 4. Hennessy Venom GT, 270 miles per hour. Lacking traction control and airbags, this model wins the title of the least safe in this list. Would you dare racing it? The Venom GT was introduced in 2011 and remained in production until 2017. Despite the seemingly long run, only 13 cars were built. 
Based on the Lotus Exige, the extensively modified Venom GT features a twin-turbo, 7.0-liter V8 engine under the hood. Based on General Motors LS7 V8, the unit pumps out up to 1,244 horsepower and 1,155 pound-feet of torque. The Venom GT hit its highest top speed in February 2014, when it reached 270.4 miles per hour on Kennedy Space Center's shuttle landing strip in Florida. Number 3. Koenigsegg Agera RS, 278 miles per hour. The Swedish maker took the lead in 2017 with this more powerful version of the Agera, stripping Bugatti from its title. The most powerful version of the Agera, the Agera RS, became the world's fastest car on November 2017, when Koenigsegg hit an average speed of 278 miles per hour. The record lasted less than two years, but the Agera RS still owns a handful of benchmarks, including acceleration from 0 to 200 miles per hour, braking from 200 to 0 miles per hour, and 0 to 200 miles per hour and back to full stop. Unlike Bugatti, Koenigsegg didn't build a limited edition version of the Agera RS to celebrate the record. Number 2. SSC2 Atara, 282.6 miles per hour. The American SSC2 Atara, 2 Atara in case you're struggling, comes in second on this list, with a pretty respectable 282.6 miles per hour top speed. That said, it's not without a little controversy. SSC is still anxious to prove that the SSC2 Atara is the fastest car in the world, and it made a second attempt. Unfortunately, that second attempt wasn't as good as the first, but it did set an official record of 282.6, pushing the Koenigsegg Agera RS out of the second position, leaving the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus as the current fastest car in the world. Number 1. Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus, 304 miles per hour. The standard Bugatti Chiron is already among the fastest cars in the world with a top speed of around 261 miles per hour, but the French firm wanted to set a new record, so it created an even more potent beast. Bugatti took the slightly more powerful engine from the Senta Dechi, rated at 1,578 horsepower, 99 more than the standard Chiron, added longer gear ratios to the gearbox, and crafted a revised aerodynamic package that increases the car's length by almost 10 inches. The modified car hit a top speed of 304.7 miles per hour on August 2. To celebrate the even, Bugatti is building a production model based on the prototype called the Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like and share this video with your friends.